So what if I told you that you could turn a raw, unedited clip like this into a viral Reddit short complete with captions, transitions, music and even b-roll in under 30 seconds. Today we're talking sub magic and it might just be the quickest and the easiest way to create shorts right now. Just upload your video and sub magic takes care of the rest. Captions, music, sound effects, transitions, cutaways, all in just a couple of clicks. It's everything you need to make scroll stopping shorts fast. You want to know how it works? I'm going to walk you through it step by step. By the end of this tutorial, you'll know how to create your account and get fully set up, upload your video and generate captions instantly, auto trim clips using AI, add music, transitions and sound effects in just a couple of clicks, and drop in magic zooms and b-roll for a pro level finish. So follow along with me and you'll be creating viral shots with Submagic in no time. First things first, we need to create our free Submagic account. So to do that, go to submagic.co or just go to the description down below this video and click the link. That'll take you straight to the sign up page where you can create your free account. And then once you're on this page, hit the create free shorts button and you can sign up with your Google account or like I'm doing here, you can just enter your email and a password and then hit sign up with email. And just like that, we're inside the Submagic dashboard. Now, before we do anything else, let's click the pricing tab here at the top because whilst the free version is great for, you know, testing it out, if you're planning to create a lot of shorts and to grow and monetize your channel, then you're quickly going to need more than that. So I recommend the professional plan. You get more videos each month and you also get like advanced features like AI powered hooks, custom captions and premium stock content. So if you're serious about scaling up, I'd say it's definitely worth it. And if you click the toggle here to switch to yearly, you're going to save a solid chunk of 41% off to be exact. Plus, if you use the code SIMON at checkout, you can get an extra 10% off. So for now, let's go ahead and select the professional plan. I'll enter my payment details and apply the code SIMON to get that 10% discount and then click subscribe. All right, so now we're back on the main dashboard and we're fully set up and we're now ready to dive in and see what Submagic can really do. So first, let's click new project to kick things off. And now Submagic gives us two options. We can generate captions for our video or we can turn longer videos into viral shorts. So since this tutorial is all about creating scroll stopping shorts, we'll go ahead and choose generate AI captions. And now let's upload our video. So Submagic supports MP4 or MOV files up to 90 minutes long and two gigabytes in size. So simply drag and drop your file or you can browse to upload. So for this example, let's say I run a travel channel and I've just moved to Hua Hin in Thailand. So I'm creating a short on the top three places to visit in Hua Hin. So I'll go ahead and upload that clip. Next, let's choose the language. So Submagic supports over 55 languages but I'll go with auto so that it detects the language automatically from the audio. And since it's just me talking in this clip, we'll leave it set to one speaker. Now click generate captions and then we'll let the AI do its thing. And in just about a minute, Submagic will go through and automatically add the captions, the transitions, highlight keywords, and even drop in relevant emojis to make our short stand out. And now our short is prepped. Let's take it a step further by trimming the clip and removing any unnecessary gaps to keep it even more engaging. So let's start by clicking the trim icon here in the top menu. And now on this page, you're gonna see your video script here on the left and your video preview on the right, and as well as the video timeline across the bottom. And if we look at the script, you'll notice Submagic's AI has already split it into sections for us. You can hover over any section and just click the X icon if you want to remove it. And if you need to take out maybe a specific word or phrase, that's really easy too. Uh, just click on the word or select the phrase that you want to remove and then hit remove from selection. And don't worry if you make a mistake, you can always hit undo to get back to where you were. Now let's say there are some awkward gaps or silences in the video that we just want to clean up. Uh, just to keep our short flowing smoothly. There are two ways to do this. So you can either manually trim the timeline at the bottom or you can let the AI do it for you, which is definitely the quickest option. So you see these gray boxes? Each one represents a break or a gap detected by the AI. 
So to remove them, just click remove silences and then choose ultra fast to delete all the unnecessary gaps. And just like that, you're done. So next, let's dial in the color a little bit to really make your short pop. So to do that, click the color button here and you can see a set of sliders to fine tune the look of your video. So you can adjust the brightness, uh, the contrast, saturation and temperature. Just slide each one until it looks the way that you want. And now let's talk about sound because if you click on audio and then turn on clean audio, this tells the AI to remove any background noise, which is super handy. And whilst we're here, let's add some music to bring our short to life. And we do that by clicking add music. Now you can either upload your own track under the my music tab, or you can browse thousands of copyright free songs in the trendy music and premium music tabs. So let's just preview a couple. And I think this is perfect for my Thailand travel short. So I'm going to go ahead and click add. Now let's take a quick listen to what we've got so far. Welcome to Hua Hin, Thailand, one of Thailand's most underrated seaside towns. In this video, I'm going to give you three hotspots that you definitely... And if the music's a bit too loud or too quiet, then you can go back to audio and then quickly tweak the volume. All right, so now I think we're ready to style up our captions. So let's hit caption here in the top menu. And yeah, as you can see, there are a ton of options here. So here's how I like to do it. You just hit play on the preview and then you can click through the different styles and see how they look in real time. So what's really cool is that it goes way beyond just like changing the fonts and the colors. It actually mimics full creator styles like Mr. Beast and Alex Hormozzi. So you get the highlights, the emojis, the color scheme, the whole shebang. And I'm going to go with this one. And if you want to tweak it further, you can just click customize and here you can change the font, uh, the font size and the font color. And you can choose how many words you want to appear at a time. And you can move this toggle here to adjust the position of your captions. And then once you're happy, just click the back arrow. And if you want to go really deep, click the edit captions tab and it literally breaks everything down, almost word for word. So you can fine tune the timing, you can add emphasis, switch out emojis and all that good stuff. But I'm pretty happy with mine already, so I'll just leave it as it is. And I think our shot is really coming together now, but let's kick things up a notch. So let's go ahead and click the B-roll button. And first things first, let me show you a super simple but incredibly powerful way to enhance your shorts and that's magic zooms. So let's click this button to activate it. So here's our video before magic zoom and then here's what it looks like after. Can you see the difference? Those subtle zooms really make your video stand out and give it that extra bit of oomph. So now let's add some B-roll to our short. So B-roll is basically background footage that plays while you're talking and it just makes your video way more dynamic and engaging. So instead of just staring at your face the whole time, viewers get visual context, which can help keep them hooked. And the good news is that Submagic makes this super easy. So click Magic B-Rolls here and the AI will automatically find relevant clips based on your script. You can also control how much B-roll you want in your short. So say for example, you want 30% of your video to be B-roll. Just adjust the toggle and then click update and you're done. Now, if you want to swap out any of the clips, just hover over the clip that you want to replace, click edit B-roll and then hit change media. And you've got a few options here. You've got free videos, premium videos, movies and images. So let's go with premium videos and Submagic will show you the clips from the library that are relevant to the script. And I do like this one. I think it works well for my short. So I'm going to click it to replace the clip. And if you're like me and you have your own B-roll, then here's how you can do that. So first, choose where you want to insert your B-roll and then click add B-roll. Next, head over to my videos and click to upload your video. Now, just a quick heads up, clips can only be a maximum of 30 seconds long. So once it's uploaded, you can click it to add it. And now you can play about with the options here if you want, but that's pretty much it. And now your custom clip is part of your short. And the AI has even added transitions in between each of our B-roll clips just to help keep the short flowing smoothly. Click any of these transition icons and you can preview them. 
And if you spot one that you like more, you can just click it again to swap it in. And it gets even better because if we scroll through the video, we'll see the AI has also added sound effects to each transition. And you can change these too. So you can click on say this sound effect here and then change it for maybe this one or this one. And if it's too loud or not loud enough, you can adjust the volume right here as well. And then once your shot is done, we're ready to export. So let's click the export button in the top right, then choose your video quality. I'll go with 4K. Next, select your frame rate. So 30 FPS is perfect for most shots, but if your video had maybe fast motion or you want that ultra smooth look, then you can always go with 60 FPS. I'll go with 30 FPS and then click export. So Submagic will now go through and render your video. And then once it's ready, you've got two options. You can click copy link to share it instantly onto your socials. Or what I recommend is hit download video to save it to your device. And then you're ready to upload it to whether it's YouTube, Instagram, or TikTok, wherever else that you like. And that's how you create viral shots fast with Submagic. You now have the know-how and I hope the confidence to start creating standout content with this AI tool. Subscribe for more step-by-step -step tutorials like this and I will see you in the next one.